The field of linguistics as a whole has very mixed feelings about the Wycliffe Bible Translators and another associated organization called the Summer Institute of Linguistics, or SIL. SIL and the Wycliffe Bible Translators were both founded by the same person, Cameron Townsend. Townsend was working in Guatemala to create a Bible translation of the Cactical language. Since then, SIL has been training missionaries and sending them to places all over the world to create Bible translations in indigenous languages. Along the way, they've contributed a lot to the field of linguistics. This is oftentimes the only documentation we have for a lot of these languages. They've also created a lot of tools and software for um, language documentation. For example, the dictionary making software that I use is created by SIL. They've created a number of fonts that support special characters in different languages. And SIL is also responsible for the International Standards Organization's uh, official list of languages. So when you use an ISO code like ENG for English, that's a code that was developed by SIL. So SIL has contributed an immense amount to the field of linguistics as a whole, but obviously a lot of people take issue with their goals and their methods. They don't think that, you know, um, Western scientists should be going into indigenous communities and proselytizing religion to them.